I'm Mr. Tap Tap, and let's play Dog Force. Um, this is a game by Cut Garnet Games. This is the Game Jam version. There's a premium version for $1.50 that uh, I'll show you in a minute here. Welcome to Dog Force! Dog Force is a game about being a dog as much as possible in 45 seconds. And look at those pigeons. They need to be chased. Sprint has changed to be the default in the uh, more fleshed out version. Dogs can do three things. They can pee on things, they can bark, and they can shake off water. Those are the only three things. Peeing on things wins you points in Dog Force. So it's a high score game where you play for 45 seconds and you try to work up your combo by doing a bunch of dog things. Like... Am I not wet? There we go. Oh, you, you hold on, hold it. You've mastered the dog basics. There's apparently some secret ways to score points too. Yes, hello Parker. This game isn't about you. This is about dogs. Unfortunately, there's a long cooldown on peeing on things. Frisbee! Oh no. Parker. Parker. Parker! Not now. Parker, this is about dogs. Get out of it. Get out of my face. Parker. So the original game is pretty simple. Parker. Seriously. Get the tennis ball. Tennis ball. Get there isn't even a dude this time. The <coughs> the maps are randomly generated. Apparently it can just not spawn the dude. There's supposed to be a at least one guy reading the newspaper like we saw in the tutorial there. All right. So that's the basic version, and the se Dog Force Seasons is the more interesting, more fleshed out version, which we'll show you right now. Okay, Dog Force Seasons is not like being recorded, but I think we partner seriously. Okay. Okay, there we go. So yeah, Dog Force Seasons let you change the season. We've got winter, Christmas, um, Parker. Uh, autumn and Halloween. And we customize our dog this time. Let's go ahead and be that husky. Let's try out Christmas time. What? I guess those are partridges or something. Nice, you melt them. Hi, Carolers. I'm not sure if barking actually does anything. I need that candy cane. Yes. It's probably the most important thing in score is not letting your um, combo go down. Give me that. For me? Why doesn't peeing on you... Why? Stupid Carol kids are weird. They enjoy being peed on, so it's not doesn't count as a dog thing. Just a weird, creepy human thing. There's so much more stuff to grab in this. The original one, like I said, it was a game jam version, so it's fairly sparse, but still a cute idea. And so this is the. I really wish this had controller support. It's got um, how do I? Oh no, not this one. Let's do a different. Come on. Different season here. It's Halloween. I said Halloween. There we go. <laughs> Pee on the graves. Is peeing on graves? Peeing on graves doesn't count. Boo. Well, now they've introduced complex mechanics, I don't understand how to- Parker, don't lick the microphone. It's shake! Ugh, I don't get how the water thing works. There we go. Oh right, a uh, review copy of this game was provided by the Itch.io uh, press program. Get that frizzy, yes! 
That was terrible, but we somehow still got a higher score than the last one. I'm not sure how that worked. Oh well. <coughs> Let's see what they did to the normal game again. I assume this is still upgraded. Barker. Barker, what are you doing? Do not make out with the phone or the microphone. Damn, look at that multiplier. Yes. Oh no, I already peed on that. No! No! That was an amazing multiplier. Look at that. See, so yeah, the score is like 99% multiplier based. Because those birds are worth like no points, but you get your multiplier up. Stop bouncing on the fence! How is that even possible? Oh well. That was an amazing run, even if we, you know, suddenly lost it. Pee on your shoes. Aww. Well, that was amazing entirely because of the combo. That is not my highest combo. My highest combo is like 55 or something ridiculous. Let's take a look at normal autumn here. Or how do I... Let's be super dog here. 80. Excuse me? Oh, I didn't mean to do the tutorial. Ah, I don't like these controls. Um... Be super dog. All right. I hope I showed all of the costumes. I've played this level before, and I do not know how to do the firework things. I'm sure there must be some way to activate the fireworks, but it eludes me. Its mysteries will forever remain. Well, mysteries, I guess. Oh no! Oh no! No! Oh, that was almost as good as the first run. Or the last run, not the first one. You know what I mean. <laughs> Shaking off better, like, give him major points. It doesn't. Well, I guess I already chucked that on that guy. But yeah, it's way harder than any of the other things to do. So it seems sort of out of place. What is it, Parker? How dare a cat play this game? Parker! Did you get my high scores again? <sighs> Parker. Wait, can I do anything with this dude? Wait, I still never figured out what barking was for. I don't think it works. Like, I don't think it does anything. It's probably not supposed to. <laughs> I love how you can, like, skid past while peeing on somebody. It's a very nice advanced technique. Like that, yeah. Alright, so this has been Dog Force. Get the get the thing. Dog! Get how Dog! No! You want it! Whatever. Pee on that guy's leg. Oh, you can what the f what? Can you stay on those? Huh. Well, that is more or less what there is to see of Dog Force. Made by Mike Cook, Cut Garnet Games, with music by Case Portman. Parker. This is a dog game. We shouldn't be here for this one. It's a defensive to your kitty's sensibilities. He's just scratching his ear at me. 